match with Crambo, I got some snailboard points, but otherwise I was getting no love from the snailboard. And also when I was on there with Crambo, we were too nice. All right, we are off and running though. Here we go. Lancer, who's already had a, a race go. earlier versus Flame Haze, yep. who was a high seed, higher seed. Mm -hmm. One of the highest seeds in our um, in our draw. Not the highest though, I think Blue Blimp is the highest. No, Above Blue Blimp draw. is yeah. much higher. Blue Blimp was at 22, Flame Haze is at 20. Lancer's at 19, but he played a really difficult schedule. So like, I think like in the ELO ratings, the fancy, you know, stats, the, Lancer's the, actually rated like ahead. The median so butt this, holder or this whatever is going to be a close. Yeah. He, no, he the ELO. Oh, ELO. Which is like right. the, the thing that chess uses to like determine who's good and who's not good. Right, right. Yeah, based on your, but it's similar to that, right? Like it's got a similar sort of, it judges your, your road to your victories and how difficult Yeah, basically. Yeah. It, it takes, yeah, it takes into account like how tough your opponents are. And Lancer played, like I said, a really tough schedule, so. Yeah. Uh, it's good to see him in the play-in because like he kind of got a little bit screwed in my opinion. Uh, yeah, I think he had a pretty rough schedule, and I mean that's just kind of the way that our tournament that's went. That's how the, Swiss the... goes. I mean that's that's a feature, not a bug. But yeah. it's like yeah, you're constantly regressing to the mean, but you overshoot it. Right. It's like an elastic band. Right. And so um, yeah, you can look at some racers like uh, um, you look at Jack. Actually, Jack had a little bit lower of a um, tiebreaker score than other racers because he actually had a little mm. bit easier of a road. Not to say that Jack doesn't deserve to totally be in the final eight. Um, oh, but, absolutely. But he did have an easier road than some of the other racers, um, which is fascinating. It's because he had some early losses, and so he ended up yeah. dropping down and then having to sort of slingshot his way back up, whereas some mm. of the other racers started very strong and um, and then got a little bit, you know, might have lost a few races and then got it a little easier towards the end. And yeah, Lancer right. just sort of found the the unsweet spot, the sour spot, where he just kind of had a really tough road. But uh, yeah, both our racers pretty close. Lancer a little bit further ahead. Yeah, sorry about the Yeah, um, the talk capture. about that Trine of Darkness. How annoying is that capture? Uh, I think it's okay. Yeah. Forgive me for not fixing it. I'm not going to fix it because then I'm going to have to fix it again later, and I think it's fine. So just watch it on a big monitor or a TV. As far <laughs> as I know, you did a great job because I'm not looking at it. Yay! Yeah, we I got like pretty Faithful different there. builds right now. Definitely different. I like Flame Haze's build a little bit more just because he's got that Ring of Peace. Yeah, and yeah, the only real similarity is uh, four bombs, a map, and shovel. But uh, now it's six right. bombs. Got the old six pack. Lancer. Yeah, I didn't quite see it, but I saw the Flame Haze had the Shrine of Darkness, but Lancer did not. Yes, but Lancer, Lancer got a map, the map somewhere anyway. Yeah, yeah. which is kind of interesting. Um, That's sort of an to... interesting question. If you have the map, do you want the Shrine of Darkness or not, like for the free shops and whatever? Yeah, I don't know. I think if you have another ring that's of any value, then absolutely not. But Yeah, I would agree with that. But yeah, if you don't have a ring, it's worth talking about because you got, you know, you find a Conjure shop or you find a, um, or a transmute shop, you'll be good to go. Oh, that 3-1 mm -hmm. gold whip though. Mm. Yeah, that's good. Mm -hmm. Tasty. Lancer Got with a, a quick pause, pause, using his pause strats. Interesting, yeah, sure. maybe he's checking his roadmap. He's got the, the sort of Necrodancer guidebook on the side. That's not a real thing, by the way, Jack. No, we should make it a thing. Yeah, apparently tonight's the night where we make up a bunch of stuff. And by yeah, makeup, absolutely. I mean just talk about things people haven't Well, yet, it like. is April Fool's, so, oh, you that's know. That's true. I usually just ignore April Fool's, because it's, it's yeah, like 95% of the pranks are just annoying. <laughs> Maybe yeah, I'm just an I old curmudgeon now, but... No, I agree with you. <laughs> but I'm also an old curmudgeon, so there you go. Aha! We got the old guys, if I'm not mistaken, um, Blind I'm not Empire. actually that old, but I f I'm old at heart. <laughs> but you've got the squeaky voice. <laughs> what? <laughs> Don't you have a squeaky voice? Isn't that what we were just talking yeah, about? Squeaky voice. Squeaky voice. <laughs> Who oh. was saying that in chat? No, that oh, that was right, right, yeah. right. Okay, I was just hearkening yeah. back to that. Down goes Flame Haze, though. That was a uh, really actually yeah. horrible situation. Sorry, I wish I pumped up the uh, the replay on that one. Um, that was really ugly. Basically, yeah, he got. Um, it was a Death Metal Minotaur Zone 3 trapdoor, and Death Metal Zone 3 is a little 
messy sometimes because oh. you got those. Um... Oh, and down he goes again. Black. Yeah, they can be really. It can be kind of questionable. There you go. Lines uh, forty. So, yeah. Oh yeah. I'm On the older side of the spectrum. So not. You're not quite forty um, yet. Not quite forty. All right. I'll be there someday, hopefully. <laughs> Such a funny sentiment. <laughs> <laughs> well, hopefully I, I make it. I mean, yeah, you're not wrong. Uh, fair enough. I do really like this current build for Lancer. Once you add the yes, warp so drum onto this build, it's really nice. Like, it gives you yeah. an easy threshold. So if a little bit of foresight, you can take out the skeletons, uh, the golems, those sorts of things pretty easily. So... I like it. Yeah, with the two damage long sword, having the war drum is really nice. You can break open crates too. Absolutely, yeah, for sure. Also, uh, the lead. shout outs to Dune and Invert for your hosts. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Uh, oh, we burned to the need scroll for armor. Oh, yeah, that's the second time we've seen that. I don't get it. It, it makes sense, sort of. I mean, well, is it going to give armor, you more you hearts armor. protected than if you had a potion? I think you'd need, like, it depends how many times you get hit, but I feel like, especially if you get leather, then there's like, no way, but you, you don't know. But I feel like... Three hearts with no armor, though, is, like, so, like, yeah. that's, like, one or two hits. But even if you purposely go down to half a heart and grab a... Well, no, I think that's then it's the same. If you purposely go down to half a heart and get the potion with three hearts, then you're kind of the same as leather, no? Yeah, I don't know. That's kind of, like... It's better if you wait, like, and take damage and then use the potion, like, just when you naturally have half a heart. But yeah, you don't want to die. That could be difficult to do, and you don't want to maybe wait. Yeah. You may want to pick up a different item. You may not want to, like, forget that you have the scroll of need, just saying. Y yeah. Uh, <laughs> why would you say something like that? That's a weird thing to I don't say. Know. I, don't sudden, know. I don't know. I don't know why that came to mind. Yeah, huh. I don't know well, why I huh. raised my voice when I said that. Yeah, that's true. You certainly did raise your <laughs> voice for some reason. <clears throat> ah, strange. Yeah, definitely. Hey, Spooty, well, thank you for the host the, as well. Welcome, Spooty. Got the armor. The, the Ring of Regen definitely uh, makes the armor a good choice now. That's a very good point. Absolutely. Taking the Obsidian Longsword. Long sword. Obsidian. That's fine. Yeah. Now you can yeah, easily one-shop Goolums with the, with the um, drum. Yeah, I just bang, bang that drum just once. Bang it. Um, yeah, but that's that. Yeah, I think that's a good call, especially since you're in zone four. You're not going to have any more trap doors. It's almost as if, like, I feel like Obsidian really increases in value in zone four just because the lack of trap doors. Like, I feel like it can. Yeah, I feel like your zone four good weapons are things like Obsidian Broadsword, Obsidian Cat, and that sort of stuff. Yeah. yeah. Whereas. The only thing that could be a bit of a problem are the Orange Blade Masters in four three. Just yeah. because, like, sometimes you want to stand around and wait for them, but then you get down to one damage. It's kind of crappy, but... Right. That is true. Other than that, though, I agree that Obsidian is uh, it's good. Swapping that... Oh, no, nope, never mind. He's got a backpack, so he does not need to swap out the war drum. By the way, uh, nope. Black Armored Skeleton getting racking up another kill, taking down Flame Haze again in Zone 2. Flame Haze, mm. unfortunately, pretty Ooh. far back. It's going to be tough for him to sort of catch up here. And that is I a like, lot of goods in those. Barrels. I like Lancer doing these unnecessary war drums to hit the barrels. You have three damage. You can just do it for them. <laughs> doing it for the swag, I guess. <laughs> you, hey, you know. You are absolutely correct. Maybe he's still in Sometimes titanium mode. Just... Who knows? Yeah. I mean, but that's this, fine. This can get ugly with these golems here if he doesn't war drum kill him. Now, so yeah, there was a good them. war drum usage yeah. uh, to hit the goal in one hit. You really don't want to spread that goo around more than necessary. Just a little bit uh... of a dunk there. He's fine. Just the shovel. That's yeah, that's fine. You've got. Yeah, gonna lower your uh, boss fight. Just eat the chicken now. Yeah, that's good. Not gonna matter. Oh, there's two chicken. Whoa. Chicken all over the floor. Honestly, chicken the floor for chicken. Days. It's uh. Oh, uh, it's the best kind of chicken, dude. <laughs> it's the best kind. Uh, maybe. Oh, by the way, with the wasting of the beats, um, we were talking obsidian, but yeah, with that war drum, it pretty much negates that issue. Oh, yeah, with yeah, the war drum, then you're totally good for obsidian. Yeah. Like, honestly, war drum is one of my favorite items, for sure. I think it's just so good. It, it, I don't know, it has so much value. Blood drum, too, but I, it's just the war drum. It's just nice. I feel like it really does speed you up, even though, intuitively, that's, like, kind of weird, because it's like, well, no. Mm -hmm because you're going to be standing still more often. But really, I don't think that's actually the case. It's sort of in first blush, that's what you think. It's like, oh, you're going to stand still more. Right. 
but you don't. Yeah, and no, this I, dead I, ringer, I we gotta mean. come up with a name for that, because we see that too often. I don't know what that is, but where the dead ringer is just zipping back and forth like that. The, the back and forth, the, yeah. The back and forth dead ringer, that's the name now. <laughs> no, I can, no, I can come up with a better name for that. Come on. <laughs> All right. You said it. Mm. Hey, it's Psychass. What's up, Psychass? How's it going? Nice to see you here. I feel like our uh, sleep schedules don't always line up very well, so, but it's nice to have you here. Psychass, of course, did most of the art for my channel. Great person. Oh, yes. Yes, very easy to work with. I don't know if you're uh, still making art for people's Twitch channels, but good stuff, good stuff. Wow, Lancer just took out Necrodancer like super fast. Yeah, that was a really, really, really nice run. Uh, definitely Nicely a done. safe one. Clap, 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 clap. Clap, clap. Oh, yeah, let me get those. I got my soundboard work. Oh, no, I just reminded you. Dang it. <laughs> do you hate my soundboard? No, no, no. <laughs> I want to do, a, I'm gonna, I should do a straw poll just to find out how many people hate it. And obviously, <laughs> I'm going to take the inverse of whatever people say. So I, I, I totally wasn't talking to the Slop House about how you use the soundboard too much. Absolutely not. Oh, man, not. I got to, no. like, come up no. with, like, a not Elad or something and hang out in the Salt <laughs> Palace and listen. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, uh, that's, that, that scares me. Hey, t ping pong ringer. I like that. That's a good one. Oh, uh, yeah, that's good. There you go. Ping pong ringer. That's perfect. That, or it could be dead name. pinger. No. I thought, like, because ringer's got the ping mm. ring. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Looks like we need to make another straw poll. <laughs> Get your straw poles going here. Straw poll. Vision problems. Oh man, that's no good. You're open for more. That's good. I hope your vision problems uh, go away. Dead pinger. Dead man. pinger. Uh, red that loses the whole. Red donger or is that reed donger? Reed, reed donger. Reed donger. I like how amb mm. amb ambiguous that is. That's like putting live and live. What does it say? I don't know. English language. Mm -hmm. Call him Pong Pinger. Yeah. <laughs> Pong Pinger is so stupid. I kind of love it. Playing catch yeah, that, with Daddy-O. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Pong Pinger it is. Is Breadbringer mod banned from Condor? It's unofficially not banned. Let's just say that. Take... Whatever you want out of what I just said. Ooh, Lancer um, wisely not killing the Minotaur. Um, I don't know if he had a sixth sense about that. Oh, but the, oh I, I hate it when the, the, the Minotaur does that though. And it's really hard to predict sometimes which direction the Minotaur will approach you from. Yes. I still don't fully understand how it works. Like. Like half the time I intuit it correctly, but then like sometimes it just, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if it has something to do with the, like, cause obviously there's like, you draw diagonal length, dry, uh, draw diagonal lines out from where the boss is. And then depending on where you fall on that line is which direction he's gonna go. But yeah, if you're I tied diagonally, I think he then continues the direction he just was in think that's right uh, uh, I think he might continue the direction he was going in anyway actually I'm not sure I'm honestly not certain though yeah me neither and but he'll also he'll go around enemies I think no wait there's some things that go around enemies I can't remember if the Minotaur is one of them mm, no I don't think he does I'm not totally sure well Flame Maze is off to a very Can't early order. start with a little bit more farming for Lancer. Uh, very yeah. minimal build here for Flame Haze. Finding himself once again in a death metal trapdoor. But this time handling Takes it. Takes care of it this time. But this is gonna be gross. I hate death metal just dagger. Oh. Good luck yeah, have so fun, do I. Flame Haze. I'm, Good luck I'm have fun. I'm with you on that one. If you, if, if, at least if you have a bomb, it's okay, but oh, yeah, just skip the skip the, like, this phase. Oh. The spawning phase because oh, you're just your not dagger? gonna make it that's uh, not a good idea no if he would have gotten the throw off before the spawns he would have been fine but um he actually uh, handled that really yeah. nicely yeah he that was really nicely done even though it was a terrible idea yeah <laughs> now you can throw it now you can throw it if he had thrown the go. dagger a little earlier and got him on the beat before then he would have been fine actually but um that's that not good 
good that is good yep so we got broadsword v broadsword yep the lancer will probably want to switch off of his at some point that bloodshot for him was a little bit uh it was kind of underwhelming good last torch is good but oh gets a gold kill that's nice Oh, Blind Umpire, you posted the results. You gotta take the R off of the straw poll there. Let me post that for you. There you go. Also got the Titanium Broadsword there. So now we really do have Broad versus Broad. Sure do. I really like taking Trapdoors with the Broadsword. I feel like it's safer than with the Longsword or the Spear. Yeah, I would totally. That agree. was something I wanted to say about the Zone Three trapdoors earlier. Is that with the spear, the longsword, they could be a little bit questionable just because of the way that things surround you from an angle. But broadsword, it's super safe. Yeah, yeah, you can just mash or flail. Same idea. I think it's also yeah. the multi hitting because yeah. if you think about it in terms of like a whip, it's a little bit sketchier. Yeah, especially oh, the definitely. chance of getting hung up on. Oh, and a nice use of the blood drum to crack on through <laughs> to the other side. It could have just gone around, but sure. Well, that was faster. It's good. Now he's it got is a faster. Now he's I mean, got a three he, damage really broadsword. That's he, good. Yeah, no, I think it's yeah. totally the right call. Three damage broadsword. He's got the boots now. That was really, really nice. But he but he bombs that wall. He could have. Although, yeah, now that I that think about too. it, he had 11 uh, bombs. Sure, whatever. Or, yeah, he had 11 bombs when he blood drummed that wall open. And yeah, maybe it would have been uh, better to just anyway. I don't know. Sometimes you have the blood drum and you just think, like, I have to use this. <laughs> That's and also you do it even if it's not a good idea. <laughs> I do that all the time. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta use it. I was hmm, I was thinking whether or not he should have taken the Boots of Pain. I would have considered it. But, I mean, you have the blood drum. You might want to keep your health. That's true. He already has, he already has Explorer's Boots, so it's fine. Yeah, Good. maybe if he didn't have that. The broadsword, though, were really good. And it's we really do good. have uh, another three damage broadsword on the other side with boots of strength. Yeah, boots of strength. Is, He's got the heavy plate. Fun. The heavy plate, though. So the heavy plate mm -hmm. sort of taken over for the uh, the safety you'll get from those boots on the other side. So. Yeah. Know, we'll see. Although he's only got a heart, oh. so he might want to. Ooh, blood drumming down to half, half, or sorry, ooh, to a potion. Interesting. And I just lost flame haze. Yeah, so did I. That's what I was ooing about. Okay. We're gonna get a pause here, maybe. Yeah, I'm sorry. When you see a duplicate uh, stream like that, uh, I think we should pause. Why did we not? Probably. I'm just suggesting it. it's not up to me. Yeah, no, it's the refs. Um, that's okay. They've they've mentioned it. We're gonna see some stream delay here. Lancer yeah. has paused, so um, we'll still see. Got a fireball before here, he did but... that. That's nice. Yeah, fireball is so good. Like it's such a good spell, especially now zone four. Just great. So flame haze disconnect. Um, so we're just gonna have to wait for him to come back up. You are watching it with like uh, multi twitch or something. Yeah, at multi twitch. All right, so just let me know when it comes back up if you don't mind. And this yeah, time sure. I'll be sure to not do stupid things. That's good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's still offline for the moment, though. <clears throat> All right, that's cool. I'm going to drink some of this drink then. Oh, yeah. You do that. Mm. Yeah. Oh, good. Um, All right, so we're just going to wait for him to come back up. He said disconnected. I'm not sure what exactly that meant, whether it was his internet mm. or his Twitch, um, like OBS or, I don't know, his controller, maybe. Probably not his internet because he apparently still has it. He, Otherwise, how would he have told us? Uh, tel telepathy, maybe. Maybe he's oh, yeah. could be, he, maybe could he's be. jacked into uh, Discord. That could be. Maybe that's what he disconnected from his telepathic connection with Discord. Mm. There you go. Yeah. Hard to know, really. Yeah. Brought to you by drink. Yeah. I actually have <laughs> several drinks here. There's just a whole host of drinks. Usually when I stream, I like to have lots of drinks on hand. All right, according to Flame Haze, it should when be I need back to quench up. my thirst. I like to drink a nice cold glass of drink. Mmm, sure mm. do. Yep, not any sort of specific drink. brand. It's good. Like Aquafina water or anything. No, to get out of here. Ew. I eat your pie. 
Uh, it is not back up. Is it back up? No, yet? I. No, I'm still not seeing it. I would have said something. How <laughs> bad Brian Clark wants our blood? Yes. That's <laughs> it. It's more our tears, I think. <laughs> Elad drink. It's what Elad drink. Elad's drink. What? <laughs> it, it's what Elad's drink. Oh, okay, yeah. Like, that Elad's makes sense. like plural. Like, like if I'm an Elad, Elad, I would drink Elad yeah. drink. You mean oh, I'm not getting... one of a kind? Well, I don't know. I was told I was. Well, there's there's Elad difficult. So there must also be like Elad easy and Elad medium. <laughs> yeah. Right. We talked about Elad easy. He's a real hit at the parties. <laughs> <laughs> well. <laughs> uh, I got I got flame haze back for like one second, but then it kind of went away again. Oh uh, boy! I don't know. Stay tuned. Stay tuned, everybody. This uh, is just the commercial break. Brought to you by Drink. Brought it's to you liquid. by Elad Drink. Yeah. It's probably liquid. I got liquid. that from chat. Although one of mine is quite thick. <laughs> it's pro probably liquid. I mean, if you freeze it, it becomes a solid. That's so. right. That's I learned that in science. Good. Good job, science. Uh, Flame Haze is back, by the way. Okay, cool. Um, cool. And just so people know what's coming up in the uh, near future, tomorrow we're going to be running our first rounds of the finals, which is crazy hype. Also, by the way, whoever wins tonight is in the money. Top eight get paid. And then, yeah, we got the finals um, starting tomorrow. We're going to get through as much as we can. They have actually figured out specifically how much. <laughs> um, I just don't know what it is off the top of my head. And then the following Friday, so a week, what time tomorrow? I believe it's 4 p.m. There is a very slight chance that we're going to have to jumble around some schedules depending on who wins tonight. Yeah. Just based on, on their schedule? Yeah. Because we've got Angelica, who's Japanese. Yeah. We've got, uh, we have at least one Euro. Yeah. Steak. Steak. Uh, uh, no, steak's... A, uh, Stakes in the playoffs outright, but you yeah, for that, tonight? that does. No, I mean for yeah, yeah I mean who the gets in, in? Who, who's in tomorrow? Because we have to pay attention for Potentially, tomorrow. Potentially, we have in to there. shift it around. Yeah, yeah. So there might be some some wacky things. Jack, I think it's four p.m. Did that get clarified that it's actually three p.m.? Uh, we just lost flame haze again. Oh god, we did. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. So are the finals double elimination? That's why we need to do it over two days. Um, that's correct. Yep. So there's a yeah, lot okay. of races. Yeah. yeah, that's gonna be that's gonna be a lot of races. Yep. Yep. It's gonna be the long haul. We're gonna see if we can get Ryan Clark to co-host for the final one, which will be good. Ooh. As per tradition, I think we've been doing that since season two. Um, so it'd be really, really good to have him. Yeah, we've had him. I remember you did it. I remember we had him in season three, but yep, I think he. I'm almost positive he did season two. Also, um, the play in. Oh yeah, he did that as well. Yeah, he might be right. Yeah, yeah. I remember that. Now. And he's such a good co-host. It's amazing. He just like beyond the fact that he knows the game pretty well. Actually, to he be knows, fair, he knows a little bit. He knows a little because, like, to be fair, there are a lot of things that the that the community knows that he's like, wait, what? Oh yeah, that's that's absolutely true. He doesn't that does know come up, which is hilarious. He's too busy. He's too busy making the game to like play it. So yeah, although I mean, also that's, that's be, not his fault. To be extra fair, he did actually play a ton right at the beginning when I when right. I first started playing. I remember he was. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he was locking down world records and all that stuff. Um, and yeah, he he played it a lot. Well, he he said that he. Um, he speed ran his game to see how viable it was for speed running because he wanted to make sure that it was a speed run friendly game. Right, um, right. So that was sort of part of his impetus for the game. Mm -hmm. All right, I got Flame Haze back. Yeah, Flame Haze is back, by the way, again. But yeah, Ryan, uh, I mean, besides knowing the game, he's just cool. He's a cool dude to talk to. Oh, yeah, that's the thing. He's or very... Seems like it. I've never <laughs> talked to him. Yeah, he's very conversational in co-hosting, mm -hmm. which is appreciated, so... Yeah, I've definitely enjoyed it when he's come on and co-hosted. Absolutely. Yeah, he's a good dude. And just fun to chat with. I don't know if you remember the uh, the interview. <laughs> I think that was at the... I do, I do remember the oh, interview. Oh, it was good times. Just so many interesting questions and things. I think that was a great interview. I think it's uh, 
highlighted somewhere, but just, yeah, it was really fun to ask him all those questions and stuff. It was really good. Yeah, he had the world record for, like, ever. It was amazing. All right, it looks like we're all good to go, so we are going to proceed whenever the racers start running again, hopefully. Yeah, I'd actually be interested to know Ryan's um, hours, but I think he wouldn't be able to know that because of... Mm. Uh, well, he's probably played a lot of builds that like weren't on Steam, so... Yeah. I, mean, I, I don't know exactly how that works, but I'm guessing that he wasn't on Steam all the time. Yeah, I th yeah. I mean, when he was doing the earlier build oh, of it. Here we go. All right, there we go. I they're at least off. got Lancer going. Yep, there they're both going. And good thing, I was a little worried that Flame Haze had restarted his game or something, but nope, he's back on the build. Or maybe all no, in yeah, that they, off time they went he got back to where he was. Me. Oh, did they? Yep. Okay, I'm gonna just do a quick refresh then on. Uh, yeah, yeah, you should uh, do that. Flame Haze. And we gotta pause again for Lancer. Another. No, no, probably, no. It's probably good. Yep, things it's are fine. fine. Everything's fine. There we go. Um, I wouldn't be surprised about that, actually, uh, Drunk. Good I think that no, Jack shielding. or Rat mm -hmm. have more hours than Ryan. I think that's pretty safe to say, actually. I don't really know why Flame Haze took the Ring of Shielding over the Frost Charm. Uh, They're, like, both about equal, except the Frost Charm doesn't take a ring slot. Yeah, and the Freeze is sometimes usable for, like, boss fights and things. Yeah, because we have way. Pearl Rift coming up, don't we? Yeah, we have Curl uh, Rift coming sure up, do. so there it is. Yeah, so that was just a misplay. That's okay. But yeah, definitely <clears throat> I, I, Frost yeah. in, that, in that choice is the better call. I would say there are some cases where the shielding effect is better than the freeze, but um, this isn't one of them. Yeah, because sometimes you kind of just, it's a little harder to scoot past enemies if they're all pylons. Sometimes you right. can kind of manipulate them, right? Yeah. yeah, like the Ringer shielding is better if you're like fighting Dead Ringer. You want that over Frost Charm. But... That's true. Oh, That's yeah. not the situation you're in right Freezing now. Freezing with so. Dead Ringer is annoying. You do not want to do yeah, that. Yeah, it's it's still it's still helpful. I mean, if you want to survive, but right. Speaking of surviving here, Flame Haze trouble, is in a he's sketchy. Trouble spot. getting to the stairs. Yeah, that go. was some hot, hot uh, floors there. Trying to get by, and Lancer just yeah. plowing through Lancer, three damage. Lancer cat. has a pretty significant lead now. Yep. Oh, bombing into another oh, shop. Some good things. Map for a little extra vision. Mm. Not so bad. I don't mind that. I mean, interesting, it's not as useful. interesting choice to pass up the earthquake scroll. Like, I mean, the the ham is good though, and I wouldn't get rid of the blood drum. Yeah, blood drum plus probably, ham is probably the better choice. That's probably what Lancer was thinking. Because yeah, I I, I think I agree. With I that. was I was sort of I was gonna say something. I'm like, yeah, I don't know. I can see why they would, he would keep both of those items over the earthquake scroll, especially with the. Uh, well, I mean, he doesn't have that much of a lead. Flame Haze is actually pretty close here. He's uh, he's only about a floor back. Well, no, about a floor and a half. But having Blood Drum and Ham, well, he's got bombs too, so he doesn't actually need Blood Drum for the Fast Necker Dancer. But it is faster, so. It is that. faster, that's true. Get that early quick hit. Yeah, have the bombs, though, I mean, I might consider going for the fast, safe Dead Ringer. I don't know. Well, he ate that Ham. Oh, he's got a bag of holding. Dancer. It's got bag of holding. You totally should take. Oh, it. whoops. Yeah, whatever. Although you still have oh, the issue of what you could use. Though. Yeah, yeah. would have had to use something. Oh, oh my God, Lancer! Oh, did he try to? He did he try to move down towards that crate and he got stuck. Oh my and then God! The dragon I them. don't know. I was looking Brutal. elsewhere, but I got the replay, so we'll find out. Yeah, that crate uh, came out of nowhere. That crate. That <laughs> crate. What? Those what? crates are sneaky, the dude. ghost crate. Oh, it's spooky. I, yeah, I, I legit did not see that crate either, so I was surprised by it. That was uh, awful. Dude, yeah, that's... Wow, bathing fire. That sucks. Wow, and Flame Haze now just has got to clutch this one out. He is not in a good spot, though. No, He's got no he is torch. not. He has... The heart. moment he gets food, he's super safe because he's got like 2.5 defense. But yeah. this is super sketchy until then. Also, keep in mind he's holding a blood shovel. So, uh. Oh. Yeah, Sudoku yeah, just is an also a, an option here. <laughs> it is possible, yeah. Beware. Careful that Norm Drum Hill is not you. There you go. But yeah, oh, his he's bounce just, traps oh, with that. Oh, God, the, the diagonal. Oh, oh, spider. The spider. 
figure it out, figure it out. What are you doing? Oh, my <laughs> God. No, you're safe to jump up oh, next God. to it. Just jump up next there's to something it. About, yeah, there's something about that spider on the bounce chat that oh, just makes me so nervous. So just terrifying. Like, yeah, yeah, I'm a spider. <laughs> he just fireball oh, spelled it. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. Just burn, just burn the spider with fireball. Yeah, oh, there you go. Oh, man. I wish I could do that in real life. Yeah, burn it with fire. That's hilarious. It's like that meme all over again. Uh. <laughs> yeah, this is really spooky. Uh. Jack saying take darkness. I don't know if Why? I agree with that. Unless he was darkness? talking about someone it. else. I guess just to get rid of the wall torches for aggro, is that what he means? Yeah. Which, I, I guess. Oh, this is so spooky. Like, the problem with getting out of zone 4 is that zone 4 does have a lot of food usually if you find some statues. Yeah, he found none of it, though. No, which is, but do you explore more? I mean, he's got the time. Maybe you want to explore it to make sure you got something for Dead Ringer, because with that heavy plate no. and full health, he could well, probably take a dunk from chest. Dead Ringer. Ooh, so there's that a... chest up there. Oh, yeah, you got to check all that stuff. you got to get over there and check it. Yeah, that could be a food yeah, shop. the shop's right here, too. Just don't Does, Is the open. shopkeeper still alive? I've forgotten by now. Uh, I don't know. With that heavy plate, it's hard to say. <laughs> yeah, it Usually is. when you see a heavy plate, it means there's that a dead shop. That often implies a dead shop. <laughs> but... yeah. Oh, man. This is some serious deathless mode. Oh, <laughs> no. no. That actually scared me. That actually oh, scared me. Oh, my monocle. goodness. The oh, light. flame the haze. Light. I was just like, when is that thing going to aggro? And then the moment he opens the wall. Yep. Oh. That this is this is why maybe you don't explore. You just go into dinner and hope. But it depends on whether or not a shop was alive. If it wasn't, then I would say no, don't explore. Well, check the food shop though. If oh yeah, the food, food shop. shop. Well, I don't know if it was, but oh. I've already forgotten so much about this seed because the long pause. I know yeah. it's hard to say. I'm sure they have too. Oh, probably. But more actually, the build right now for Lancer is quite similar to uh, Flame Haze. Uh, yeah. He found a lot I actually, of the same stuff. I really like the gold broadsword ring of courage. Two damage broadsword courage. Oh, it's great. so good. Yeah, That's you you can good. just zip right through enemies. It's like a little better than courage because you're doing infinite damage as you go. Can't zip through that clone though. They jumped into before going down the trapdoor. I thought he was gonna get hit by that shopkeeper. He goes for a second. I was really scared. No, he's fine though. It's flame haze just kind of just sitting this one out for a yeah, second. Yeah. Uh... That's generally frowned upon um, in Condor because obviously yeah. Lancer is only at the end of Zone Two. So if Lancer oh, you dies, can, you can catch up. Like yeah, this he, race is not over. He could have caught up, a. But also, what happens if Lancer gets to Zone Four Three and dies, and Flame Haze is just sitting there? He could mm -hmm. have had a very slow, safe run going and and gone for a victory there. So just always got to keep it up. Keep pushing. No one see the ham crate. There was a ham I crate. I didn't. I didn't see. The ham I crate. didn't. I've. Uh, I did not see the ham crate. He did have monocles, so I don't doubt that there was one. I just didn't see it. Oh, he had monocle too. Oh my god. Well, that's why. That's why he got hit. That's that's why he had the problem. Oh, of course. Light. Yeah. Oh, look at this though. Love it. Whoa. That was. Yeah, awesome. the frost burn. There you go. The zip through that pile of enemies there. <clears throat> Is the stream frozen? It might be. Uh, let me check. No. Okay. He's just sitting there. I mean, his stream might be frozen, like, on his end. I don't know. It's not on our end, though. Yeah. Oh, man. It's so spooky to do, uh, blood, or sorry, broadsword strats with, uh, courage on, uh... It can be. Good use of shield oh, there. Oh, God, still run away! Of... He's gotta run! Get to the no, chopper! he's got it. He's good. There you he go. got it, yeah. There you go. He's got the three damage broadsword next. He's got those boots. That's pretty sweet. Get the heal of the spell. Get the blood heal. There you go. It's got a really safe build now. Yeah, sorry, there's a quick pause here. There's some discussion going on. Oh, in so the he Discord is offline. Um, sounds like. I have him online still. No, I, I do too. Uh, Invert's saying he's offline, but then he said JK, so I guess he's uh, pulling one of those, oh, those classic April Fools. April Fools jokes. Got us, Lord. Classic invert April Fool's Day. Classic, jokes. yep. Every April Fool's, he always pulls one of those 
He's actually offline that, online jokes. That, that was quite the jape. Oh, he japed us good. Jape. That's a oh, word I don't hear wow, that, very that, often. That mommy was about to jape Lancer pretty oh. hard there. That was scary. Yeah, that word is not a good word. <laughs> I don't like it. The tri jape? Triggering, triggering me. I love the word jape. <laughs> jape. It does. It actually reminds me of Donkey Kong. So that's good. Like Donkey Kong Country. <laughs> jungle, jungle Japes, jungle right? Jungle Japes. Yeah. 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 There you go. April Fool's first joke. That, that, <laughs> see, that's proving my point. That's the exact caliber of the majority of April Fool's jokes. Well, it's great because you could just you could do that joke on any day of the week. I mean, it doesn't have to be an April Fool's oh, Day. Oh, well, it's because it's such a good so, joke. Yeah. You well, yeah. Whenever. Whoa! Using Ooh. the spider to crack that sack shrine. Trying to sacrifice. Yeah, for nice. And a cat, a sure. Solid, yeah. solid uh, items, too. Yeah, I could take either of those weapons and be pretty happy with them. It doesn't even make sense to scrub some goof. I don't even know what you're talking about. What you talking about, everybody? Luck charm! Uh, leprechaun, leprechaun's back. out of there. He's like, I'm out of here. Screw you St. guys, Patrick's I'm going home. St. Patrick's two weeks ago. I'm gone. Yeah. Man, why doesn't April Fools have like a, a lovable mascot? I guess because it's a, uh, it's, a hated, uh, it's a hated holiday. Maybe that's why. I guess I don't know. <laughs> Doesn't deserve one. I mean, see, the thing is, we have the internet now, so every day is April Fools. Because yep, there's that ham. Uh, there's crate. so much in misinformation. There, yeah, there's the ham oh, crate. Oh, so, so it was all on the way that over there. side. Oh, okay, so we. So can... he needed. If he had gone down, he wouldn't have died. I want to see what's in right. there. I want to see. Open it. Open it. He's gonna open it. It looks okay. It was a pawn shop anyway. It was a pawn shop. Someone said that they thought it was a pawn shop anyway, which might be the case because i can't remember if there's a food shop yeah i don't remember not. seeing it i'm not paying attention to that yeah Whatever. we're just commentating we're not paying attention yeah Come on, guys it's not our job to like pay attention to things yeah it's our job to make april fool's day jokes yeah exactly i mean and, and by that i mean jokes about april fool's day yeah, not, not like actual, jokes on april fool's pranks, day that's yeah. there there should be a distinction here Good distinction. All right, so Lancer now just trying to finish this one up here. He's got the blood drum, um, and he's got bombs. Looks like he's going to full blood drum this. Questionable. Uh, yeah. Probably use some bombs there, he's but I guess the he wants to keep the turnips on the stage. He's got the shield. He's got two hearts. He gets the free hit for doing that, so I understand it. Yep. And oh, Flame is now careful. offline. Ooh, yep. There we go. All right, and angry uh, timer reads 1740 on that one, but Lancer oh does win, so Lancer's gonna be moving on, eliminating Flame Haze. GG Lancer. Off, but we don't GG. Care anymore? Sorry, Flame Haze. GG.